Howdy cowdies. Weekly walkabout time at the collector. We've got another bloody good auction this week. Heaps of cool stuff. Nice little horn snuff box. Some Collingwood membership medallions. And there's two in that bag, 1990 and 1958. They're a couple of premiership ones. A bunch of scout pins and badges. They're all MCC membership medallions. Old Collingwood Coles cards they look to be. It's pretty cool, the men's Tissot sort of 1970s digital watch. More Scout stuff, more Collingwood stuff. Some Scanlon's Wacky Plaques. Old footy cards. A nice little Scottish uh, agate silver brooch over the back with a hat pin. Currency, silver napkin rings. Another nice little lot of gents watches. With a lot of costume jewellery. Little silver salt pots over the back. Some nice stuff. What else have we got? Little Dexter rocking chair. Kind of like this little sort of oak chair there. Put it with a couple of mirrors. Lovely big oil painting by Ernie Trembath. Really nice thing. Little boxes. Sort of blokey pins and badges and stuff. More scout stuff. Chromo lithos. Costume jewellery. An ostrich egg with a funny little carved bone pen or pencil. Yes, we've got big lots of jewellery and badges and stuff. Ephemera. Train postcards. What else have we got? Pretty cool old pair of New Balance runners from the sort of 1980s. Games, old photographs, golf clubs, gaming gear. We've got some cool gaming gear I'll show you soon. What else have we got? There you go. Nintendo 64 games in their boxes. Footy stuff, Little Britain. Stereo gear, it's a great box of cassettes and stuff. What else have we got? Big tricycle bike's pretty cool. Washing machine. It's pretty cool. The Xbox sort of store display thing. <laughs> Slot car sets. The Nissan R381 Racer's a ripper. It's been partly made. Uh, boxes of books. Brand new um, Adidas and Reebok shoes with some other ones as well. Skateboards and more games and stuff. Train gear, die cast, stereo equipment. And there's Phil Spector's wall of sound. Yeah. <laughs> what else have we got? Australian pottery. It's a good big bloody flat screen TV. There's no stand though. It's been mounted on a wall or something. Uh, books, footy gear, EP. Little sets of books. Big surfboard. Pretty china and stuff. Brassware, bottles, nice little lot of ephemera, toolboxes, costume jewellery, pretty china, good little group lot with some raw strand and other sort of boxed Arabia gear, AP, cool little singer, adjustable lamp, a little lot of die cuts, some great sort of sheet music covers in this little lot, some really cool stuff. Sort of Italian gear. Yeah, it's a big Patrick Hennigan self-portrait oil painting. Nice thing. It's by Angelo Burgoyne, Aboriginal oil painting. This is a nice big Sid Mather. Really nice thing actually. A nice palette and everything. Nice little pair of Hank Guth oils. Pretty typical. What else we got? This big fishing rod sort of repair or making machine with some box of tackle and stuff. This is a nice little uh, British oil, this, on card, about 1910. There's it by R.A. Wakers, or Dakers, it is, on the back. just can't remember his name off the top of my head. It's a good little thing, though, that. little impressionistic thing with a guy carrying his firewood home to his little sort of cottage with the smoke coming out of the chimney. Really nice thing. Alfred Clint watercolours a ripper. Beautiful sort of nude deco lamp with a big green mottled glass shade. Diver's helmet. He's a ripper. What else have we got? Good lots of china and EP. Some cool little nursery lamps. More EP and art glass. Some nice little books signed by the author. Uh, china. Dolls and a Furby. Die casts. Uh, petty cartoon over the back there, cool old wall mount phone, 
Star Wars gear, including the Lego Stormtrooper. Uh, camera gear, more gaming stuff, nice lot of china and glass, Royal Albert and stuff mainly. Diecasts, good little box locomotive. Nintendo, uh, Super Nintendo console with a couple of games there. Some lovely uh, theatre programs, some really nice sort of art deco covers and stuff like that on them. And that Clara Bow one's an absolute cracker. Uh, glassware, more Capsella toys, a couple of nice little lot of oil bottles there. Little Johnson Brothers nursery set's pretty cute in the box. A lot of blokey gear, cash box, nutcracker and a tobacco jar. I think there's actually tobacco in there. It's probably worth more than the friggin' jar actually these days. <laughs> this pair of lamps. Diecast, signed Bobby Skelton bit. Some interesting um, unframed works on paper. There's a big uh, rose of garlic, one in amongst there and some other pieces. Thomas the Tank Engine gear, good English china, nice lot of crystal, Wedgwood and Dalton, a couple of nice decanters, lots of nice stuff this week guys, collection of green glass, some nice sort of domestic jars, old footy and other newspapers, got a little lot here of model kits and stuff like that, it's mainly instructions and decals, I think in this little Tempest box. Pretty sure it's full of, yeah, all different decal sheets. And there's some Nintendo, um, just a NES and a uh, little hand controller in there and some Game Boy games and stuff. This is a good little box of gear here, toys and stuff. Three good Nintendo 64 games with their boxes. Oz Pottery, Elisha, Wembley. Collingwood Footy Club gear, Pretty China, Glass. It's an old massager or vibrator thing. My Child. Tin toys, Japanese stuff, a couple of nice little bits of Oz, a little photograph, some slot car races, a little Ford RS200, a nice little Tanberg original uh, cartoon illustration. What else have we got? All the Japanese 1930s stuff, the mobile footy albums full of all the cards, Dalton, nice little lot here with Wedgwood, Shelley and Moorcroft. Uh, what else have we got? Carlton Wear, Mailing, some nice Grimwade's Luster, a couple of nice bits of unsigned Australian glass, little canister sets nice over the back. Kind of like this little pewter arts and crafts beaten tea set. This is a nice little lot with this little candlestick with the big sort of dome snuffer. There you go, asbestos iron. Great little lot, these the Olympic glasses in the original box. Uh, what else have we got? Little cruet sets, nice. Some more really nice deco theatre programs. Victorian cast iron. Uh, Royal Albert, this looks to be, I'm pretty sure. Yep. What else have we got? Nice big bits of glass. The little Dewar's decanter zeripper. Another nice little bit of Dalton over the back. It's got a mismatched, mismatched lid though. The lid's not original. All these bits of glass glow, Wembley, Pilkington Lancastria, Barbara Swarbrick pot, or bowl, nice little Granger Worcester, tri -vars. i got some nice stuff up the top, Moorcroft Comport, Moorcroft Lamp, Moorcroft Candlesticks, another Moorcroft Comport, Amphora, a couple of nice bits of signed glass, lovely bit of carnival glass, there is a chip unfortunately, and this is a nice little... Uh, yes and no, Bellboy Monkey, lovely French Art Deco Squirrel by Charles Lemonceau, I think it is. It's a shame there's a little bit of damage on his tail, but he's a lovely bit of French Art Deco. You can see it a sign on the bottom there, and she's a lovely bit of Art Deco as well. Original photograph, try and get a better shot, like a sort of reclining model. There you go, the world's desire it is called. She is absolutely lovely. Yep, there you go. You know me, I could keep rattling shit for another 20 minutes, but that'll do. Gonna be a good sale, hopefully we see you on Thursday night, and we have got the heater out. <laughs>